What's good, everybody? Back again this week for the video. Could be showing you guys my top 10 favorite sneakers in my collection. So right here I have all of my top 10 favorite shoes that I have in my collection. I have about 65 pairs or so um, overall in my collection. They range from Jordan, Nike, Adidas, Timberland, Reebok. I've been collecting shoes for about four years now. Uh, let's start with the first shoe right here. All right guys, it's the LeBron 11 Everglade colorway. I like the icy sole on this. It's real nice with the just all black with the hints of that uh, tropical green, orange, and yellow. I'm a Miami Hurricane fan, so it's uh, kind of the same colors that they wear. Uh, I just like to wear these with like some black sweats or something and throw on a white shirt. Looks pretty nice. I got these like in 2013 or 2014, I can't really remember. I paid 200 bucks for these. Second shoe we have right here is an another LeBron 11 uh, shoe. This time it's the low edition, and this is just the gum bottom colorway, the insole all different colors these are the only shoes that I have with the actual gum bottom um, I can just throw these on with pretty much anything I like to wear these a lot these are one of my main go-to shoes that I wear got these back in 2014 and I paid 170 bucks for these I was working at a shoe store at a time so I was able to reserve my pair only LeBron's I have are the 11's um, I really like the 10s and uh, I had a pair of 9s actually that I played basketball in in the high school of the LeBrons. I have uh, the South Beach 11s, I have the What the LeBron 11s, um, I have the Graffiti LeBron 11s, um, you saw the Everglades and uh, yeah that's it. Alright guys, the next shoe on uh, the list is the Bread aka Band 1s, Air Jordan 1s. Um, these are definitely one of my favorite shoes ever. Um, I wish I had the Chicago's. I missed out on getting the Chicago ones two times already. These are the 2013 edition. I do have the 2016 or 17 edition as well. Whichever ones just recently came out. But these are the ones before that. These are definitely one of the my favorite shoes that I have. Um, at the time, there was a very limited amount of these that came out. Um, where I was at the time and I was able to grab a pair. Um, they were really limited, so I was pretty happy that I got a pair of these. But. All right, next shoe on the list, I got the Cement 4s OG edition with the Nike Air in the back that just came out this past year. Definitely been wanting these for a really long time, just never been able to pay resale prices, but I got these for retail um, back when they released. They're only a really nice shoe though. These can go with pretty much anything. And uh, usually when you put these on, people are gonna be you know, looking at looking at your feet. So definitely one of my favorite pair of shoes that I have. And definitely one of the favorite pair of shoes that of Jordan that have ever released. All right, the next shoe on my list is the Air Jordan 11 uh, Concord Highs. I do have the Concord 11 Lows that came out. These are definitely definitely in my top three in my collection. They are pretty old. They're already yellowing at the bottom and stuff. Uh, up here is getting a little bit yellow as well, but they still really nice to me. I like the I like the 11 lows too. Um, 11s are definitely my favorite shoes, uh, Air Jordan shoes that I have. 11s, ones, and fours are definitely my favorite shoes. And next up is we got the Fear Fours. Um, I think my top three colorways of the fours of all time. I just love these with the all black and gray, uh, gray scale color. I'll go with pretty much anything. I got these back in 2013. Um, I don't remember what they retail for, but yeah, these are definitely super nice with the suede up top. This is the only shoe that I have from the Fear Pack. Um, didn't like the threes and the fives that they released the Fear Pack. I didn't like the colors at all, the orange on the threes I think and the 
fires I didn't like with that olive or whatever it was. But yeah, it's the Fear 4. Alright guys, next up on the list is my number one favorite Jordan shoe of all time. The Space Jams. Space Jam 11s. This past year was the only year that I've ever been able to get them. Uh, couldn't get them in 09, I think, when they released. Um, but these are definitely my favorite shoes of all time. For the Jordans, uh, I wish that they would have gone with the 23 back here instead of the 45, but still, super, super clean. These are actually one of the only shoes that I haven't worn yet. Hopefully, within the next couple years or so, five years, they'll release the one 23 in the back. Um, but still really happy to get these ones. Number one favorite Jordans of all time right here. Next up on the list is the Bread 11s. Uh, this is the shoe that pretty much got me started um, with wanting to get a bunch of sneakers. Got these back in 2013, I think. Um, they are a size too big for I me. Mean, they're a size 13, but I still make them work. I'm a, usually a size 12. I have a couple size 13s, a couple size 11 and a half, but I make it work anyway. Really looking forward to when they release these again. Um, I'm also really looking forward to the 11s that they're going to be releasing this year for the holiday release, the all red 11s. Those are going to be super nice. Um, yeah, I wear these a ton. My opinion, one of the nicest colorways for basketball shoes that have ever been made. I mean, it's just so, so simple yet so nice. Just the black, white, and red. Everybody knows about the bread 11s. I mean, probably one of the most famous Jordans that there are. One of my favorite pairs, one of my favorite colorways. This next shoe, we got the Bel Air 5 crazy colorway. Um, inspired by the Fresh Prince of Bel Air and Will Smith. Um, we got these back in 2013, I believe. It's the crazy shoe. I mean, we got pink and lime green and blue everywhere. Got a pink tongue on this one, a green tongue on this one, with a all gray top don't really wear these a whole lot it's not really much to wear them with one of the craziest colorways that i have and one of the more limited shoes that i have all right the last shoe on my list that we got is the bordeaux sevens actually the only pair of sevens that i have um, not a huge fan of sevens but this colorway i really like when i think of these shoes i think about the picture with michael jordan and michael jackson and wearing these shoes, finally a shoe that I've been wanting for a really long time and was able to get a couple years ago or last year whenever they released. They didn't sell out, I was surprised, they kind of sat for a while, but whatever. Easier to pick up for me. But that's the last pair on the list, the Air Jordan 7 Bordeaux. All right, guys, well, that's the whole video of my top 10 favorite shoes that I have. Uh, thanks for watching. If you're new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button um, for more videos. I'm gonna be going on a lot of benches in a couple weeks. Going to Phoenix in a couple weeks. Going to Migos in Future in a couple days. Going to Washington, D.C. after that. Um, yeah, so make sure you stay tuned. Life. Life.